this year's group uh, of the Insurance Apprentice is an excellent bunch of youngsters. They've learned how to collaborate, uh, they've learned how to take failure uh, where they have failed, they've learned what leadership actually means. Where they have grown is uh, as people. What will have changed for them is a greater knowledge about themselves. They will be more marketable. The Insurance Apprentice is a phenomenal program. Basically, put me out of my comfort zone. For me personally, it's been a learning experience. The insurance apprentice sets the foundation for every young person. I think it should be a preliminary course into the insurance industry. I think at this, all uh, all apprentices, uh, you know, this what they're made of. We'll be going away from this program knowing so much, uh, not only about myself, but uh, about the industry. It has been a character building and uh, a, a very emotional, you know walk for me in, in my development. I found out uh, things about myself that never were really pointed out. It's definitely not a walk in a park, but what you take back from it or what you take out from it can be used in every other avenue of your life. You know, my belief in myself has grown so much. I've learned life lessons on how to interact with people. Uh, you know, there's, there's, a, there's plenty of things I've actually learned in this program and I've really uh, encourage you know all the youngsters that are in the program to actually give it a go. Overall, it's been an amazing experience. I can't really, I can't say much more because it's just been so amazing. I believe that FA News has come up with a very good concept of the insurance apprentice. All the building blocks are in place for actually using this as a, uh, as I said, as a, as a, as a, a way to actually um, profile the insurance industry in a very positive light. It's going to be quite difficult to select the apprentice that is going to take over the role of the insurance apprentice 2016. I'm extremely confident that I'm going to win. I'm highly confident and, um, and, and uh, pretty certain that uh, I will be the 2016 insurance apprentice. I, I believe I'm there and thereabouts. I don't, I don't think there's any clear front down at, at this point in time. I think it's a very, very close competition. We've all done exceptionally well. I'm a strong contender and will win. Insurance Apprentice 2016. I do believe I am the Insurance Apprentice 2016. I would like to win it and I believe that I've done as much as I can to show that I really want to win it. There's no clear winner. When you come into this program, please make sure you know how to put together an, ex an executive summary. <laughs>
Okay. So, the, there will be a top three insurance apprentices, and in no particular order. <laughs> Alicia. Andre. And lastly, Chris. Congratulations, guys and girl. And the winner of the Insurance Apprentice 2016 is Andre Brooks. Congratulations, Andre. Give me a congratulations. I just want to say what a pleasure it is for Lloyds to sponsor the first prize, uh, which will be a visit to the Lloyds and writing room. It's a week-long visit, so I just want to congratulate Andre because he is going to have an opportunity to mix with uh, the best minds uh, or talent in the underwriting world. Thank you, Lloyd. Incita um, is giving a bursary worth um, 70,000 rand. What a journey. Um, firstly, um, let me start by, by saying thank you. Um, thanks to FN News, Renette and the team, Myra, and all the sponsors for, for making this all possible. Um, without you, I'd, I don't think you know, we would we'd have been able to pull the show off as well as we did. Uh, the judges as well. You guys were fantastic throughout the show. Um, I'd like to thank my family, friends and colleagues for all their support you know, for me throughout this entire journey. Yeah, that, that, was, that was also awesome. Um, my campaign manager, my wife, she's here tonight. Thank you very much. Without you, I, I would also not be standing here tonight on the stage you know, uh, with this acceptance speech. So I love you, babe. Thank you. The, the experience itself was, as you guys would have noticed and witnessed from, from the episodes, was challenging and nerve-wracking. But I think overall fun. I think we, we all had a, had a great time. And personally, I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Might do it a little bit differently. Maybe not. I mean, but I, I'd definitely do it again. Um, to my fellow competitors, I salute you, all of you. I mean, it takes a world, a world of courage to enter the show, to put yourself out there, take yourself out of your comfort zone, and, you know, basically subject yourself to possible scrutiny and, and criticism and... Um, I mean, that, 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 that's brave, and, and I salute you for that. I still believe and that it was a very, very close race. I, st I think it was anyone's game. So, I mean, that, that to me is just testimony of the caliber of competitors that we had this year. And for that, I salute you too. And then I'd also like to lay down a challenge tonight. And I challenge all young insurance professionals to come out and, and, and enter the competition. Enter the competition and test the metal against the best talent the industry has to offer. Because it, it really is, it's a worthwhile experience, and the exposure is tremendous, and it's, it's, it's life-changing. In closing, I have a couple of points that, that resonate with me. I'd like to share them with you. And you, um, you may be able to, re to relate from, uh, from the show itself. The first one, an executive summary. 
is a summary and not a thesis. Less is more. When faced with CAC, if you don't know the answer, don't speculate. <laughs> Never be afraid to tell the client what he's not covered for, irrespective of how intimidating he is. When doing a risk survey, pay attention, otherwise you won't pick up the stompies. <laughs> Less is definitely not more in that case. And lastly, never ever underestimate the popularity of Justin Bieber. Thanks guys. <laughs>